what are you trying to achieve with your um, research? What, what would be an ultimate, optimum outcome? Oh, an optimum outcome would be understanding the nature of consciousness and life and the universe and reality. <laughs> okay, the big questions being but answered. More, but more modestly, a desired outcome would be to identify specific neural substrates that are associated with religious practices and religious dispositions and spiritual practices and spiritual dispositions for the eventual goal of translating them into complementary and mm. integrative healthcare approaches. Um, there's been tremendous work, really groundbreaking work that's been done looking at things like mindfulness meditation. And you know, back in, I don't know, the 1970s or so, when you had psychologists and scientific researchers who were starting to look at meditative practices that came out of the, you know, the Far East. Um, it, it, at first it was considered to be eccentric, um, and yet fast forward a few decades, and now the idea of integrating mindfulness with cognitive behavioral therapy or with other forms of clinical health is very, you know, mainstream. Yeah. It's something that, that it's not even, in some ways, you know, it's not even considered alternative. It's just considered, you know, a very um, uh, almost routine mm -hmm. way to, to integrate holistic practices into clinical care. So Dr. Ferguson is going to be our grand round speaker on Tuesday, March 1st. And uh, we invite our viewers to, to join him and learn more about his work. And he's going to be presenting on neurospirituality, science, circuit, and soul. So is there anything else that you'd like to add to, um, to just fill out a little bit of what you're going to be presenting um, on March 1st? Um, so I will be discussing a vision that is much more ambitious than I'll ever be able to complete in my own career. And so I would say come ready to collaborate and to think together and to get excited about ways that we can integrate neuroscience, spirituality, and patient flourishing. Thank you so much, Dr. Ferguson. It's my pleasure. Thank you.